So now that we have the dot product and vectors in Rn, we can use this to actually define uh, the orthogonal projection of a vector onto another vector and normal components of the vector. So here we're given a vector f, and we want to find the parallel and normal components of f to this vector v, where f is the vector 2, comma 3, and v is the vector minus 2, comma 2. So recall that the component of f parallel to v, or the orthogonal projection of f onto v, is given by this formula. Sometimes written uh, proj v f, and we write this as f dot v divided by the norm of v squared times the vector v. Um, you don't have to worry, this is not a dot product here, this is a scalar. So this is just scalar multiplication of the vector v. And we have the formula that the normal component of f with respect to v is f minus the parallel component. Cool, so we have this formula now. And we calculate. So let's first do fv. So this is just going to be uh, minus 2. We don't have to write it all out. It's going to be minus 4, which is 2 times minus 2, plus the 3 times 2, which is going to be 6. And the norm of v squared is going to be v dot v. So we see that v dot v is going to be minus 2 times minus 2 plus 2 times 2, which is just going to be so minus 2 minus 2 plus 2 times 2. Well, this is 4 plus 4, so 8. Simplifying this, we see that this is 2, so we get v over 4. Okay, and now that we have that, we can solve for the component of f normal to v. So we take the initial vector, 2 comma 3, and subtract 1 fourth, 2, 2, where this is just going to be f v. You should probably write that up there. Okay, so simplify this. This is 2 minus minus plus 1 half comma 3 minus 1 half. Again, simplifying it down, this is 2 plus half to 2.5, which is 5 halves, and 3 minus 1 half is 2.5 as well. So. We have this is five halves, comma five halves. So the component of f parallel to v is one fourth times v, and the component of f parallel to, or sorry, normal to v is five halves, comma five halves, and that's it.